The St. John Fisher football team might have defeated the U of R in the third annual Courage Bowl, but for 10-year-old Tristan Hartman, his favorite part of the game didn't have to do with the score. This whole thing's just for us. This whole game's just for us. Tristan was one of three honorary coaches for the Cardinals. Gary Mervis, founder of Camp Good Days, describes what the honorary coach's job entails. And they get a chance to attend a practice the week leading up to the game so they can meet their fellow coaches and players. Then they meet their team uh, for the pre-game meal. And if it's a team that's traveling, they get on the bus and ride over on the bus with the team. Uh, all six coaches go into the locker rooms with their respective teams. They lead their teams out onto the field, and it's always a night game, whether it's played at the U of R or over here, so it's before thousands of fans. They get a chance to go to midfield for the coin toss, and then they're on the sidelines. And it really gives them a chance to experience what it's like to be part of college football team, an experience that would not otherwise ever be available to them. Tyler Smith, another member of the honorary coaching staff, felt that meeting the players was a highlight of his experience. Some of them I bet if they wanted to could just crush me. Oh, I bet, yeah. <laughs> like that. <laughs> for these boys, the Courage Bowl was not only a victory for the Cardinals, it was also an experience of a lifetime and a dream come true.